Hey guys, it's me, Shupivy. Um Today I'm here to give you some tips for um, H. Ross's death run and a walkthrough if you get stuck, because it can be quite confusing at times. Uh, so first of all, with level 1, before you start, make sure to grab this coin here. Um, and then stop, and then just begin. So it's pretty simple, just follow these walls and be careful because here there's a trap. Um, and this is level one. This is probably the most straightforward level, but you know what to do. Uh, you literally, it's just parkour. Be careful though, because you can hit your head on the ceiling on those, on these two high bits. There's one there as well, but it's very simple parkour. Let's see if we don't mess up on this last jump. And then there you go. So level two, stick to the right. Um, for the first bit that is true. And then when you get to here, you want to spam A as, as much as you can. As you can see, I just missed it there. But pretty much, uh, that's what you do for that part of the level. Okay, so there you go, that's how you do level 3. Now wait for the ice to wear off. Could take a while. Now this level is quite confusing because there is um, death barriers everywhere. So there's one here, you can see if I walk through it, get killed. So what you have to do here is essentially um, go forward here and jump onto that platform. Now it might take you a couple of tries, uh, it's not that hard. Then onto this one, then onto this one. Now there are some bullseye things, targets, which indicate um, changing directions. So once you get here, you change direction. Once you get here, you change direction because everywhere else is um, barriers. Because as you can see, if I don't go on this, so you need to stick to that path. Now, um, level four here. Um, this one might take you a couple of tries, but what you've got to do is do that and then move to the right. See, I just missed it there, but you have to stick to the right and then quickly turn up like that. Now, level five is a trap tunnel, so what I recommend you do is die and just run through the first three easy peasy like that right let's see if we can do this for you maybe not Okay, right, now this is technically level 6 now. Uh, this should be, yeah. So make watch out for that trap here. Now, basically, as we can see, this is barriers. Um, and essentially, when there's an arrow in the way, that means there is not a block. So you can either drop down and bait them, like so. and then you'll fall through here and go this way uh, make sure to not fall this way okay because this is a um, this will kill you so what I recommend you do is you you can actually do a block jump if you go right up to the end and then jump and then you can literally jump straight through and make sure to not miss the bouncer like I did otherwise you'll not get to the next part of the level
when you get up to here look for the arrow that's pointing straight say this one and you want to go straight up like that as you can see it's pointing straight whereas the other ones are bent watch out for this trap here and this is level 7 which is arguably one of the hardest to begin do three bot jumps like this not hard then you get into this area now all of this is covered in uh, invisible death barriers so you want to line yourself up and jump right then you get to here you want to jump onto here like that another one here not so hard and be careful here as well because these are block jumps so if you can line yourself up like that turn around do a block jump right now this is the hardest jump I'm going to try to do it for you now so once you make that jump aim sideways and just go up Alright, once you get here, this is a pretty easy slide challenge. Jump up the edge and then literally go through the doors. It's just it's that easy. Now this is level 9. You want to grab one of these and grab one from 9 and then sort of try not to pull this through. Here you go. I did it in 3. Now take your impulses. First jump, pretty straightforward. The second one is quite challenging. Alternatively, you can walk down the floor and go right up to the ending, but I'd say that's cheating. When you get onto this podium here, you want to simply line yourself up. <laughs> oh. And as soon as you open the chest, you finish the run. Collect all these coins here and make sure to do these things here. And that's the end of the run. Hope you guys enjoyed and maybe you might be able to complete it for yourself now. And if you have already, GG's. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one.